So basically this is how the garden looks like now. All done by Mister. It's not a terrible garden. Well I've got form hanging on my form hanging. As a D, as a form you need if you be a moon. I hate I will say we need to put artificial grass here because but yeah, anyway, this is how the backyard looks like. Let me go back so you guys can see the whole garden. So that's from from this side to that side. It's quite big, but not that big. Yeah. So we can have our summer party here. I'm thinking of getting a mini swimming pool for baby D. So I'm going to place it here. Or probably on the pavements here. But yeah, all done by Mr. CB. He did so well. He has made this house look very pretty and beautiful. Now it's time for me to take over in the house, you know, clean the house well. So let's go and see the front, uh, the front of the house. I don't know if it's a front garden or whatever where you call it. But yeah, let's go and see that one. How he did it. The reason why we did this, as I said in my previous video, we have dogs who come here and poo and the owners don't clean it up and it's really frustrating. So we had to think of plan B of what to do. And also because, I mean, we had trees here and it was giving us too much job to do all the time. So the easiest way to go was to do this. And uh, I love the fact that, um, you know, it gives it a new... Um, What's the word? It makes it, it makes this uh, the front of the house looks beautiful, I would say. And I guess we need more stones because there is still, you know, uh, 
places that needs to be filled like for instance over there if you can see yeah i don't know why this whether it's the flowers or what i don't even know what to call but the why is this one here we need to put i mean you need to cut these off it's not nice in the middle of i mean it's different if they were flowers that but it's not a flower so i don't know why it's here no i don't like it it's not nice it doesn't make the i mean this place looks nice so over there you've seen over there it still needs more filling and uh yeah we're just discussing about the fact that we need more stones here but the, i think the stones are nice and uh <coughs> mr acibe did this why are you running away huh why are you running away yeah he said he's tired but yeah congratulations he did all this by himself but uh, i think you need to close that part because that part is still there yeah this part how do you lose it still? i don't know but you can't just leave it there like that that's how it is no you can't just leave it there like that now what do you do that's i don't how? know that's because when you check the, the other guy's home how did he do it it's the same thing he just kept his to close the side let me just go back and see how this place looks like yeah i think it looks good but we need more stones as i said to make it look more better i am this all for today Today's Sunday and I'm so excited because I've met a friend and also a subscriber. That's Francesca all the way from London. So literally I was supposed to vlog on Friday and Saturday but I couldn't. But uh, yeah, I did vlog about the program that I went to. I mean the event that I went to. But I'm going to show you the friend and the subscriber. <laughs> this is Francesca. Hi. She's Italian. We did it by Forza. Ciao tutti. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share, okay? What do you see? <laughs> yeah, so guys. <sighs> so we just returned back from the range. We went to uh, Poundland. We've been to the Asian shop. We've also been to, uh, what was it called? Where did we go? BNM, we went to Card Factory, the wex.co.uk. So they normally sell um, books uh, if you are an artist that you like designing, drawing, and all that. Yeah, so I went there to get some um, canvas so we could be painting whilst you know enjoying our picnic. But unfortunately, they didn't have it. So I realized that the other time I saw it at Poundland. Just next to my house over here. So uh, when house becomes, I would, you know, go back and get it. But for now, I'm tired. I need to prepare the soup. I am so exhausted. I just remember that I also have to prepare jollof rice because tomorrow we are on a road trip. And listen, your girl is so so tired. Literally, I just want to show you guys the items that we bought. So yeah. So the first item that i'm going to show you is this so this is goat meat anyway this boy is full of goat meat and i paid 10 pounds for this guys things are very expensive now this all this is 10 pounds but i'll say that uh the price is okay because if i had gone to a ghanaian african shop i would have paid more than this the reason why i didn't go there is because first of all this is, uh, is not fresh because it's been preserved in the freezer and I needed fresh goat meat so I had to go to them to get it so yeah, this is 10 pounds all this to prepare the soup and for the beef bear with me and I have here beef so the beef is not that much this is also 10 pounds so the guy told me that the beef is more expensive than the goat 
I don't know why, but that's what he said. And then also, I bought suya pepper mix because Mr. Sibe wants uh, rice balls with palm nut soup and also kebab. So I'll be making kebab as well. So I bought suya pepper, which was one pound ninety nine. So there is it. So and uh, it's eighty grams. So eighty grams of suya pepper is one pound ninety nine. I also purchased um, Derica Doppio Concentrato di Pomodoro. This is Italian. And when it comes to thin tomatoes, I mean tomato paste, if I don't make it from home from scratch, I buy this brand. So this is the Rica and this is uh, 850 grams. I'm going to use half for the jollof. I have here my, in let me pronounce Inkulelu. <laughs> oh God, my tree is terrible. Inkulelu, Prakase and Abedru Palm Soup Base. So this is the palm soup base. This is what I'm going to use to prepare the soup. However, it contains precursor, which is aridan seed. Hey, no, aridan fruit, which I've already mentioned in my videos mostly because I use it to prepare my soup. I blend some, I add it to my tea, I add it to hot water, I drink it like that because it is also good for your health as well. And the abed, abedru. A bedroom is a uh, turkey berry. So turkey berry is also good. It gives you iron. When you are pregnant, you need turkey berry. So let me show you what turkey berry is. So this fruit, I don't know if you can see. I'm going to attach it also here so you guys will see. But this is turkey berry. It's very good when you are pregnant. You need that. I blend it. I, a friend of mine taught me, uh, taught me how to, you know, uh, blend it and then drink it just like that. And trust me, it really helped me when I was pregnant. So if you're pregnant out there, or if you are, if you want to get pregnant, let me just inform you. Uh, turkey berry is the way forward. And also spinach and the greens, greens, green, green. Green vegetables. Eat that. So yeah, this I didn't buy. Uh, Mr. Sibir bought it yesterday. So I'm just going to show you quick, quick, quick all the items that I bought because I'm running out of time. And also I bought gari. So gari is made of cassava. Uh, this is straight from Ghana. As you can see, it says Ghana Gary. They have a whole bunch of Gary from different countries. But listen, I'm a Ghanaian girl representing Ghana. Can you see my kente? Yeah, my African cloth. My Ghanaian African cloth. So yeah, I bought Gary. I also bought uh, this air uh, freshener that lasts for eight weeks. So I'm going to place this all over the house, the entire house. I bought four of them. I've already got some, but I bought in addition these. I also got this for Derek because when I'm, you know, preparing his um, potatoes, I normally use the earth, earthwork bowl. Is it the earthwork? How, what's it called? Earthwork bowl or earthwork bowl? I don't know. Asanka. I'm going to show you a picture here. So that's what I use, but now that I've got this, it's easy for me. I, just, I can just match it. So I bought this as well. The scissors in the house gone missing by Mr. Sibe. He can't find it, and I can't force him to go and find it. So I bought a new one. It's not that expensive. This was this one pound. Yeah, and uh, as usual, one of my favorite spices, I bought this Aromat. I also got this for my hair because I've run out of the one that I use. If you've watched my previous videos, regarding the hair products that I use you realize I use this that one was infused with castor oil but this one is infused with sweet orange oil so I'm going to try the sweet orange oil as well I bought tea tree oil I bought uh, argan oil as well because I'm going to mix my oils so yeah that's what I got I also got um, hibiscus you know flour to prepare my zobo sobolo or hibiscus drink it's a healthy drink and I need this at this moment. Yes, I've been missing this. So yeah, Saturday during his birthday party, he will need this. I also got these for Derek. His birthday is approaching, God willing, September. And I plan on celebrating it for him. So I got this for the children uh, at church. So when I'm making their presents, you know, anytime I have birthdays, I tend to give out gifts as well. So I'll be putting this in all the, you know, children's bags package for them so I got these as well and this each was one pound so let's say three pounds and the hibiscus this was expensive because I don't know if it's because they realized that this during the COVID people were buying and that's why they've increased the money 
This is three pound ninety nine. Where can take take two way? Hey, I have to ask my girls in Ghana to send me some. Derek also got this for daddy. So if you're watching this video today, your baby chose this for you. So this is daddy bear. This is Derek, and this is daddy. <laughs> So your birthday present is gonna go in here. <laughs> he also got this for Derek, baby D. So when we go to the beach, he can, you know, ride his car, but he can literally use it in the house as well. What else did I get? I also got this for Ja. I bought three of these because I'm gonna use it for Saturday for his birthday, of course, because I bought one huge one. However, it has no leaf. So I got these and they were on sales at the range. So this is £2.99. So if you happen to go to the range and you want a jar, this is £2.99 it's on sale. So go get one. So yeah, bear with me. So I bought three of these. I also got these bowls because when we are eating fufu, the bowls that we use are too small. So I got these for us. So this was also, uh, I think, one was three pound ninety nine. So the next items were these flowers. I'm gonna use it for the picnic, so uh, I'm gonna decorate, you know, the the table with these. I bought this each was two pound forty nine. So I bought four of them. So these are the colors that I wanted to use. So let me put this also here. And then obviously I bought my picnic, you know, uh, rag. This is a picnic blanket or whatever you call it. So I, bought, I bought this the reason why I chose that there were so many options but the reason why I chose this is that this you've got you can literally take this along with you wherever you're going as a, even a hand luggage because it has this uh, handle here which you can use as a you know bag or something yeah so yeah you can hold it this way either this way or that way and this to my surprise it's five pound ninety nine, literally, and the size is uh, I think hundred and fifty per hundred and thirty five, which is very long, and it's waterproof as well, so it's good. So go grab one from the range, five ninety nine. Anyway, this video is not sponsored anyway, yeah. So there you go, and uh, yeah, so this is the other jar. Derek, come, come. So this is the other, uh, the other jar that I was talking about. Let me just place it here. And then obviously I got these um, microwave and fridge freezer wipes. Yeah, I'm going to use to clean them. Mainly used for fries and veggies. If you want to have uh, a particular uh, shape of how you cut your veggies and your fries. So I got this as well. This was £1.99 from the range. Go get one as well. I'm going to use this for saturday as well because i don't tend to have them that's why i bought it because i'm going to put in the soup and also my rice bowls so yeah so yeah this is also it's three liters and two liters so it's 15 pound 99 next item is this so this is two tier uh drainer so when you wash your dishes i've been willing to get one for so long this is always not remind me of it. Now I've got it. It's 14 and tonight and I just grabbed one. So yeah, I'm gonna use this today. I'll wash it and I'll place it there for you guys to see. But yeah, these are the items that I literally bought from bought from the range. Oh, that the honeymoon's just a phase Now I understand, I learned the first thing You thought it would last forever oh, oh. You should So hello lovely people Yeah, my skin is glowing Thank you for that Today is Friday 29th July so it's the day before Mr. Sibay's birthday so the plan was to take him to Pathma. Um there was a particular place that I wanted to take him to however uh, 
plans changed because First of all, he refused to drive four hours to that place because from Manchester to that place is like four and a half hours, depending on the traffic. If there's too much traffic, then literally that would be five hours. He refused to drive, literally. That was what happened. And let's just say that because he refused to drive, he also said driving there will be let's say let's assume me there's five hours and then returning is five hours so that'll be 10 hours on the road and he's not willing to do that but because it was a surprise i didn't let him know where we were going and i'd already paid for it uh i was a bit disappointed not a bit i was disappointed let me use the word i was disappointed and um but i thank god because i rang them and told them that we weren't able to come because of personal I mean because of family issues so I didn't get a refund but I'll be going there with um with Derek and also Kit's sister so since he's not gonna come with us we'll be going alone however we managed to come to this place and uh, what's this place called literally is a uh, so that was um, Desmond's brother who literally found this place and uh, I think it's a very nice place to be fair it's a huge park so if you have kids if you like hiking sailing walking all that fun this is for you I didn't vlog because I was in a good mood to do it you know when you plan something and all of a sudden um, because someone or something just you know uh, comes up I mean something comes up and you're unable to do that particular thing or you're unable to go to that particular place your day messes up and your mood switches and that's what has happened now so I'm just gonna enjoy because it's not my birthday it's this birthday so we're just going for this walk uh, he's going to change with his brother and another friend of his and then they'll be going to they'll be going on the boat I think but because I'm scared of the water, I wouldn't be going with them. We'll be taking walks. As you can see, I'm taking walks with my lovely son here. And uh, yeah, that's what we are basically doing. I hope he has fun because it's his birthday. It's not my birthday. So uh, let's see. Let's see how the day goes. However, tomorrow we have good plans. So uh yeah i'm hoping for i'm looking forward to the picnic indoor picnic and also in the evening we'll have just family um you know dinner and then after that we'll be having movie night so that's what we'll be doing tomorrow and then sunday i think we have another location to go that's oh this is beautiful look so i don't know if you guys can see over here all these people are a bunch of people with babies and we're going to join them. We want to see what's going on there. People are having fun. I hope Derek loves it there. Oh, look, look, look. I don't know if you can see. I'm just going to get closer so you guys can see. So we are in the Lake District. So we have the Peak District and the Lake District. But at the moment, we are in the Lake District. So yeah. Let's just hope that we have fun. You know. I just love the place. This place is very, 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 very peaceful. I love it because when you're taking walks, you know, you have this sound mind, this peace, you know, surrounds you. And the place is all green, nature, green everywhere, green, green trees, green park, green, 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 green everywhere. And I love it here. Even though I'm not happy that we couldn't make it to, you know, the surprise location that we were supposed to go to. But anyway, yeah.
so these are some of the activities that you can do here so you can do bow tie uh, kayak tours mini tractors uh, bike high mini golf tree top trick and nets brave the cave you know a bunch of stuff so this is the lake national park Mario and the last is Be video is so Mario pa mon bra I pay down mobile on the Mario pay down sir bo mo ya di o o mu ko from ha to e chiri ho to ma di pass next time e ko ana che ze mo e na me meti me let you go if you don't want to let me know Tired of feeling so lost to say yes or say no Something needs to change I'm done pondering how I'm clarity no more Say no. 